everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new here i am mc and i'm so glad that you found me i love all things luxury i love luxury bags shoes luxury beauty lifestyle and vlogging today i'm doing a louis vuitton unboxing and it is a very special piece it is not an empty or a made to order or custom made but a seasonal piece from the fall winter 2023 collection this particular bag is a type of seasonal finish which is produced in a limited quantity and only available in a short period of time of three months after the season production will no longer be available and what makes this more special to me is special because i picked this bag to replace the capucins bb which i returned due to some issues as you all have seen in my previous videos and as part of my agreement with louis vuitton i can choose any bag i want based on the current value or price of the capucins bb remember that i purchased the bag for 278,000 back in june 2020 the price now is 395,000 pesos so if i'm going to get the same model i won't be paying even a single cent anymore the only time i would pay for additional is when i upgrade which i planned and did so that's how i got this piece it will always be very special because it reminds me of my former capucins bb now without further ado here is my unboxing the most expensive louis vuitton bag in my collection my ca said that the packaging is different or special than their regular bags it's heavy what are these all right so these are three pieces of perfume samples which is nice so this is different indeed look and you could probably guess what it is so i'm going to open it up all right Oh, it is very well packed with all these tissue papers. And I love the sticker. I don't know if you can see it. There you go, because of the lights. But it's really beautiful. Okay. So. Ah. <laughs> and here's the receipt. Oh, this is really special and there's also a like a letter in here certification this is to certify that louis vuitton blah 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 uh, there's a description of the bag it's my first time to receive a letter or a certification like this and here's my receipt We have two desk bags right here, a small and the bag. Let's just move the bags away because it's quite heavy. All right, so which one? I'm gonna open this up, the dust bag. Can you see that, guys? Louis Vuitton is embroidered or sewn in here. We know what the regular dust bags look like. And even the dust bag is special there's a leather tab says louis vuitton Ta -da! it is an exotic capucins in the mini size in ostrich leather oh my gosh this is really really gorgeous stunning when i saw this i just fell in love the color is so beautiful and there's nothing quite like it in my collection i mean the finish this is something so this one is a purple pearl purple pearl i'm gonna inspect it first oh so purple pearl purple pearl oh my goodness it's a tongue twister it is a type of seasonal finish which is produced in a limited quantity whereas the other ostrich bags they have like the orange uh yellow green 
or uh, fuchsia belong to color and are in matte. Color is usually being offered quite longer than seasonal finish. It draws inspiration to monotones. That's why you can see some uh, LV ostrich mini capucins or even capucins uh, BB in plain single colors. And they are a bit lower in price. On the other hand, uh, finish draws inspiration to anything that is uh, composed of two or more colors like this. And for this capucins, the main inspiration is a purple pearl. It requires more craftsmanship and expertise than color. Finish also requires additional technique to achieve it, so it is more expensive than the color ones. Well, that's what my SA explained to me. And this finish has a sheen, like a real pearl. So I believe that it is not really prone to dirt and scratches, and it's easier to maintain. I do love it. It is perfect for evening use or for special events. In case you wanna know how much additional amounts I paid to get this bag, well, I paid 130,000 pesos. The price of the BB now less the price of this ostrich, which is 525,000 pesos. So I was short of 130,000 pesos. But in reality, my total cash layout was 408,000 pesos only. If the BB had not increased its price, it would have cost me 247,000 pesos additional. So I was able to save 117,000. Really? Did I? You know what I mean? Well, anyway, why did I choose the mini over the BB size? I was wearing my Lady Dior medium at the time, and I noticed that it has the same uh, size as the BB. That was when I went to Louis Vuitton to pick uh, the replacement. And I realized that I have many bags in that size, like in medium category. You know, I like wearing small bags now. And my love for small bags started during the pandemic. My lifestyle has changed. Well, I don't carry as much as essentials like I used to. And this size, this color, it's great for evening, for my evening use. Perfect for any occasion. It is more elegant, very light, especially it's ostrich. So now I'm going to show you the interior. It has a goat skin lining. Beautiful. Other than that, the features are exactly the same as the regular capucins. There's a slit pocket right here at the back. And of course, a compartment dividing the bag into two. And it has a light gold metal hardware. It comes with... I almost forgot this. A removable and adjustable thin strap. And what is this? Gloves. What will I do with this? And there's also a booklet. And I think these are instructions on how you care for the bag. Look at the strap, guys. It's also made of ostrich leather. It's really beautiful. But... I like to use the top handle, so I'm just gonna keep the uh, strap in case. So what do you think about this bag? I know exotic is not everybody's cup of tea, but if ethically sourced... Anyway, this wraps up our video for today. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave your comments below. Like, subscribe, and hit the bell for new videos. Remember, always stand for your rights. Bye!